Okay, oopsie. Okay, I think I'm still here. Hello, my friends, hello. Can you do that after me? Your turn, go ahead. Hello, my friends, hello. Now I'm gonna do it in another language. Bonjour, mes amis, bonjour. You try it. Bonjour, mes amis. Bonjour. Now let's try Spanish. And I hope you're singing because you are on mute, which is good. But I, I want to read your lips, so make sure you're doing it. <laughs> Hola, mis amigos. Hola. And I think it's mis. Your turn. Hola, mis amigos. Hola. That's right. Hola. Your turn. Hola, bonjour, your turn, bonjour, hello, your turn, hello, we could go with many languages, namaste, your turn, namaste, shalom, your turn, shalom, good job, good job, well, in Music for Minors too, we always want to say to you that you are musical because you have the most important instrument of all, and that's your voice. And you have your body that you can make percussion sounds with, right? Let's take two fists, though, right now. Everybody take two fists and put them together, moms and dads and friends and relatives and neighbors. <laughs> and this is like your brain inside your head. Because you have a left side and you have a right side. Now, when we walk and talk, this is what our brain looks like on a brain scan. Now, go like this and go like this. This is what your brain looks like on a brain scan every time you experience music. You mean music connects both sides and builds bridges and my brain is working better? Yes, that's why we have to have it in the schools and in your lives, children, because your brain is growing and developing and music feeds your brain while it touches your heart. Now, who can do this? I can sing up high. Your turn. I can sing up high. That's your high verse, your high voice like a little bird chirping. Now watch what else your voice can do. I can sing down low. Can you do that? I can sing down low. Good. And now go right in the middle. I can sing it in the middle. Your turn. I can sing it in the middle. My turn. Or anywhere you go. Go ahead, echo me. Or anywhere you go. Now make a fist and pop up your little pinky. And put it right here. And you just said, I. My turn. I was born to make music. You try it. I was born to make music. Good. And my turn. I was born to sing a song. Your turn. I was born to sing a song. And the second time it's sing out loud, but don't worry about the lyrics. We just want to get into the groove of the music, which is so good. So I'm going to put it on and I hope you can hear it because here we go. Born to make music, we were born to sing a song. We were born to make music, and if you like, you can sing along. Reach up high, I can sing up high. Sing down low, sing it in the middle or anywhere you go, because I was born to make music. I was born to sing a song. Now you're going to get it, so keep trying. We're going to do it two more times. So let's do it. Yeah, that's good. I was born to make music. I was born to sing out loud. Sing out loud. Born to make music.
music and if you like you can join our crowd i can sing up high sing down low sing it in the middle or anywhere you go because i was born to make music i was born to sing a song now we get to do it again and let's sit up nice and straight and you could stand if you want i was born to make music i was born to sing a song i was born to make music and if you like you can sing along real high sing up high sing down low sing it in the middle or anywhere you go because we were born to make music we were born to sing a song sing it again born to make music we were born to sing it last time because we were born to make me watch me born to sing a song watch me sing a song yeah good job good job wonderful job so that means we were born to sing we were born to open our mouths and sing, to move our bodies to the beat, and to have so much fun, because that's what music does. It helps us to come alive and feel wonderful, doesn't it? That song does. It sure woke me up, I know. And for those parents who don't know enough of who we are, I'll just give you a little brief thing. Music for minors, too. If you can see my logo on this side. <laughs> says that we are a nonprofit keeping music in the school since 1988. We're actually entering our 33rd year of keeping music in children's classrooms and lives. How do we do that? By people like you parents or in the community, anyone who loves music and children, we train you every fall and you get to learn how to share wonderful music with children in a classroom once a week for one half hour and it's all free to take the training to get all the materials and to have the time of your life sharing music because you become alive too you get the joy you get to feel how wonderful music is and how it helps us especially now that we've all been closed up in our houses and this virus has just robbed us of so many wonderful things. But don't worry, we can get it back with music. And that's how we're going to help you. Now, tonight, you're going to hear from a lot of people who are going to share music with you. These are our volunteer docents. They're called music docents once you're trained. And they will be having you get up and move. They'll have you sing. And I'll come back and have you do some instruments, too, with us. So I'm going to now turn it over to um, probably Vera. Or no, actually, yes, there is Vera. <laughs> And she can introduce herself, herself, and she's a docent at Parkmont School. Carol, are you going to do the two fists thing? I already did it, Vera. I did it in the beginning. So remember, everybody, remember, your brain now looks like this because we just did a song. We just had music together. Okay. So Miss Vera is from Parkmont School. She's also our program manager, and I'll let her take well, over. Welcome everyone. So let's get ready to do some dancing. We are going to be doing the Mexican hat dance. This is a partner dance. So you will need your parent or a sibling to join you. So go find your parents or your brother or sister. Okay, I see a few parents coming here. So this is a very easy dance. Oh, I see his dad's come as well. Very good. Okay, so let's all stand up. Okay, watch my feet. In, uh, mm, this way. Can you see my feet? So put yes. your hands on your hips. Yes, I can see your feet. Good. So we're going to do heel, 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 clap, clap. Can you try that? Heel, 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 clap, clap. Now we're going to do that too. Four times, so three more times. Heel, 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 clap, clap. Heel, 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 clap, clap. And then one more time. Heel, 
heel, clap, clap. Now you are going to get your partner and you are going to swing them. So I've got my teddy bear. So that means you take your partner, you put your arm underneath and go around in a circle like this. So parents, we're not going like this. We're not going this way. Take opposite hands, like you're shaking someone's hands. Take their hand and then go under their armpit. And go around like this. That's it. If you haven't got a partner, find a teddy bear or cuddly. Lassie, find a teddy bear. Have you got a teddy bear? No? And then when I say, when I say switch, you go the other way. Let's go around the other way. Very good. And then we go back to the beginning again. Okay, I think you guys have got it. Okay, let's get ready for the Mexican hat dance. Okay. Heel, heel, heel. Heel, heel, heel. Heel, heel, heel. Heel, heel, heel. Okay, grab your partner and around. beginning. Heel, heel, heel. Heel, heel, heel. Heel, heel, heel. Go around again. Mira, that was wonderful uh, dance. Thank you so much for sharing with us. That was a nice warm up, isn't it, boys and girls? Yes. <laughs> That's up. If you like it, yeah. There you go. Okay, so we have we have our Memorial Day coming this weekend, and we do need to learn some patriotic song for that, isn't it? So let's learn our patriotic song. Um, and uh, that's going to present our wonderful docent Jay Jayanti from Brookwell Elementary School. Here we go, Jayanti. Take it from me. Hi, friends. How are we doing today? All good? It's awesome to be here. So I have my two children here as well, and they study in the Brookwell Elementary School. Um, so yeah, like what Ms. Priya said, we have an important day coming up and we would love to share a song, a patriotic song that we can all learn and we can all sing together, okay? So let's all get started. Um, this song pretty much has um, marching going on through the song. So uh, can I see my friends march? Do we know how to march? Yes, yes, left, right, left, left, right, left, yes. So your arms can be straight or you can bend your arms a little bit and then you can do your marching. So either way works, but the entire song, our body is going to be marching, okay? So march, 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 all right? So we are going to have some actions in the song and we are going to have beautiful, lovely music. So I'm going to teach you every line and I hope you can catch my actions too. But 
uh, it's more important that we enjoy the song together. So don't worry about catching every action right. Not at all. It's not it. Not at all required. But let's all try to uh, learn and enjoy the song together. Okay. Let's go for it. So I'm going to share my screen for the words just so we understand what we are singing. Uh, at the same time, try to see my little screen and try to catch my actions as well. Okay. All right. Here we go. Share. Okay. So I hope you guys can see my screen now. All right. So the first line. We get up each morning. So it'll be my turn first, followed by my friends. So for we, we get up. We're going to show this action where we usually stretch our arms and wow. then yawn. Okay. So we get up each morning. Your turn. We get up each morning. And greet a new day. So in the American Sign Language, uh, this is for day. This is what we do for day. So we and greet a new day. Your turn. And greet a new day. We know that. So for free, we try to. Uh, so this is how we keep our fingers. And we try to have them together and then we are releasing them as if we are getting freed okay so this is what we are doing here we know that we are free to be living our way your turn we know that we are free to be living our way good job so the next line is we are free to be sane what we want to say. Your turn. We are free to be saying what we want to say. Nice job. And for happy, this is the American Sign Language for happy. So we do. We are happy. We are living in our USA. So for USA, we just get our fingers together from both arms and then we make a circle. So um, uh, your turn. We are happy. We are living in our USA. Very nice job. So uh, following this, we'll have a same line that repeats four times. And this is how it goes. Um, we, we are living in the heart, in the heart of America. So for this, when we sing the heart, we are actually going to tap on the heart. So we are living in the heart, in the heart of America. So for, when we sing America, we want to do a firm sal salute to show our uh, respect for the country. So we try to have a firm salute. That way, you know, just have a nice body posture and try to do a nice salute. Okay. So my turn. We are living in the heart, in the heart of America. Your turn. Your turn. In the heart, in the heart of America. So that's repeated four times. We're living in the heart, in the heart of America. Your turn. We're living in the heart, in the heart of America. So that's repeated four times. And then following that, we have four more uh, lines. Very similar tune coming up. So this is how it goes. Uh, so when I, after I sing, you repeat. Okay, Saru? Thank you, Raputi. We live in, we live in a land where our dreams can come true. So that's again, I think we're going to march to the song and we're going to say, we live in a land where our dreams can come true. Good job. A country with choices. So we can just show the choices. Country with choices for me and for you. And then uh, similarly, a place where, so the freedom word is back. So we again try to keep our uh, like uh, crossed uh, arms and then try to separate them. A place where our freedom will always shine through. Your turn. A place where our freedom will always shine through. Nice job. And again, for the word happy, 
we made this action. And for the flag, if you have an American flag at home, you can just point to it for the red, white, and blue. Uh, otherwise, you can make this uh, sign for the flag. This is the American sign language for flag. So you can just do, we are happy to live with the red, white, and blue. So your turn. We are happy to live with the red, white, and blue. Nice job. Um, so there's going to be music throughout the song, and you'll hear some violin pieces, which is which is really uh, melodious. At that time, you can just, along with marching, he could just do this uh, violin action. And in between, uh, you'll also hear the flute sound, and you could just do the flute action. Yeah. So uh, I'm here to prompt you. You can follow me. But these are all the things that you will see in the song. Uh, apart from that, there'll also be music, and then uh, uh, there'll be a piece where you will actually have to stomp twice. So that'll be like, you'll have to count one, two, three, four, stop, stop. Listen to the heartbeat. So try to do that with me. One, two, three, four, stop, stop. Listen to the heartbeat. So this will uh, come like four times. Again, we'll all do it together. And at the end, we are going to just sing the word America three times, uh, and then followed by three times uh, going going up and coming down. So this is how it's going to sound. America, America. Your turn. America, America. It's going to come thrice again, and then at the end, it's going to end with the heart. That's how the song ends. All right. So I hope we got uh, an idea of how this song is going to go. So I'm going to quickly share the music and let's try to perform it together. Okay. Here we go. All right. Okay. All right. Here we go.
you. Thank you so much, Jendi. That was wonderful patriotic song. Thank you so much for teaching us tonight. Thanks okay, to boys and girls and parents, this is something which is going to be the next thing in our show. Oh, what is this, by the way? Do you think it's some some sort of food thing? What is this? Do you think it's a avocado? <laughs> yes. Yes, and that's what we are going to do right now with our teacher and the executive director, Miss Carol. Miss Carol, here we go. Yes, thank you. I love that. Thank you, Priya, for showing them an avocado. Now I'm going to show them another object. Can you all see it? Maybe not so much. There it is. This happens to be a plastic egg. It looks like it could be an avocado according to the shape, huh? But it is a plastic egg that you may have seen around Easter time. And something is in it. See if you can figure out what's inside. Something in your kitchen cupboard. It's rice. Now you could put little pebbles. You could put popcorn kernels. And you have a shaker. And maybe you can make one of your own after this program, unless you can quickly find one in your house. And I, they come in different sizes, right? You could have a big shaker, or you could have a little one, or maybe you have something else in your house that you can shake. But who knows what this is? This is a shaker that was made in a factory, and it's, it's an official instrument called a maraca. Maraca. Why are we doing this? Because the song is guacamole, which you make from the avocado, right? You mash it, you put spices in it, and you make a dip out of it. Oh, is it good? I love avocados and I love guacamole. So you can tell by now that our program has a theme going through it. It's either patriotic songs for Memorial Day celebration, or it's songs about Spanish or Mexican uh, folklore and people. And that is because Cinco de Mayo happened. May 5th is already passed. So we want to do a little bit of those. So if you have a shaker, if you don't have a shaker, just make a fist like this and pretend you have one. Because Mrs. Zilli is going to go up and down, up and down. And if you have a maraca, quickly go find it and bring it back. So the song goes like this. Me first. And again, if you don't have one, don't worry. Use your imagination and your fist is just fine. My turn first. Guacamole. You sing that. Ready? Go. Guacamole. Good. My turn. I'm going to change it just a little bit. Guacamole. Your turn. Guacamole. Now watch. I'm going to turn it and I'm going to rotate it when I sing. I really, really like guacamole. I do. Your turn. I really, really like guacamole. I do. My turn. Guacamole. Your turn. Guacamole. My turn. A little higher. Guacamole. Your turn. Guacamole. My turn. I really, really like it. I do. So I lower my voice that time for the word do at the end. Here's part two. I freeze my maraca or my egg shaker. I just freeze it and I take my other hand because I'm going to get my chip and I'm going to dip it. So it goes like this. Take a chip. Dip it. Dip it. Your turn. Ready? Go. Take a chip. Dip it. Dip it. <clears throat> Excuse me. My turn. Take a chip. Your turn. Take a chip. Now listen to this part. Dip it. And then I'm going to go guacamole with my loud voice. Not shouting, but a nice loud voice. Go ahead and do guacamole. Guacamole. Yeah. And we do that again. Take a chip. Dip it. Dip it. You try it. Take a chip. Dip it. Dip it, take a chip, dip it, guacamole. And then we start all over again. And it's so much fun. So show me your shaker. Did anybody grab one of these? Oh, good. I see some out there. That's great. <clears throat> so hold it. Now, there's a fun part in the song that I love. But it goes like this. We shake and we cut. 
Cut means we stop. We stop the sound and we just freeze. We just freeze our maraca and then we won't hear it. So let's do that. Shake, cut. Shake, stop. Okay, we'll do that. And that's my favorite part of the song. Okay, here we go. So get ready with your shaker or your official maraca. Let's hope Mrs. Zilly's got it. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, gosh, gosh. Let's try it again. Should be there. Mm. There it is, guacamole. Turn it. Really like guacamole. I do guacamole. Guacamole. Turn it. Really like it. I do. Now freeze it. Take a chip. Dip it. Dip it. Dip it. Take a chip. Dip it. Guacamole. Take a chip. Dip it. Dip it. Dip it. Take a chip. Dip it. Guacamole. 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 Turn it. You really like guacamole. I, move your lips. <laughs> guacamole. I really, really like it. I do. Now we won't sing and copy me. One, two, three. Other side. Two. Now the fun part. Shake, cut. Shake, cut. Shake, cut. Shake, cut. Take a chip. Take a chip. Dip it, dip it, dip it. Take a chip. Dip it. Walk a mole. Take a chip. Dip it, dip it, dip it, take a chip. Dip it, guacamole, guacamole, guacamole. Turn it. I really, really like guacamole. I do guacamole, guacamole. I really, really like it. I do guacamole. Good job. Give me a big ole. Uno, dos, tres. Olé! Good job. Oh, I'm so glad you found a shaker or a maraca to have fun with. Oh, so, so, so good. All right. Thank you so much, Mrs. Zilly. That was wonderful. And this is for you. You bought <laughs> our world. <laughs> okay, boys and girls. So let's get ready for a dance. Oh, who doesn't like dance? And by the way, our next docent from Nile School Elementary. She is a wonderful docent and she's going to teach us some very special dance. So let's get ready for the dance. Come on. <laughs> Here you go. No, no, Gloria, sorry. I missed her name. I'm so sorry about that. Hello. Thank you, Priya. Hello, good evening, everybody. Good evening. Let me see your faces. Let me see your faces. All right. Tell me how you feel, guys. One to five. When five is great, one is terrible. How do you feel? You feel five? Show me, show me, show me. I love this five. Okay. So, you know, guys, thinking about tonight, I thought, oh, I would like to share a nice dance song that I do, especially, you know, when, when we sit at a computer for a long time and you feel like you cannot move anymore. That's what I like to do. It's a dance call. Stand up and sit down. And you know, it's important also for another reason, because it talks about a music, an element of music, very, very important, called tempo. Do you know what it is? I tell you, it's a secret. No, it's not a secret, I tell you. It's a good thing. So tempo is the, um, it's one element of music that tell us how slow or how fast we're going to sing and play. Imagine, give me thumbs up or thumbs, or th or thumbs down if I'm doing things wrong. Imagine I'm singing happy birthday and I'm singing it. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. Would that be okay? <laughs> Give me a thumbs up or thumbs up. No, no. That would be a sing sad it. birthday party. It would be like, <laughs> happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. That's much better, right? Thumbs up. So every song has, its own, has to be played or sung 
I could go and fit some songs that are beautiful when they're slow, some songs that are beautiful when they're fast. And today we play with this song. And I see from your faces that you're going to be great. So we start with slow. We're going to do some movement. You just have to listen and, and, and do the movement that, that you're told. And uh, we start slowly. And there we go. Faster and faster and faster. And let's see where we go. Okay. Are we ready? Thumbs up if you're ready. Thumbs up if you're ready. All right. Okay. Um, okay, it's like this. Okay, be ready to stand up and sit down. Okay, so I go a little backwards so that we can sit. Okay, now we are doing it slowly. This tempo is called like adagio, very slow. Okay, so stand up, everybody. Sit down, stand up, turn around, turn back. Sit down, stand up, sit down. No, this is the first part, second part. Stand up, sit down, reach up, reach down, reach up, stand up, reach down, sit down. We'll do it one more time slowly and then we'll start going faster and faster. Are we ready? Are you ready? ready? Here I have my assistant. Ready? Okay. Slowly now. Adagio. This is Adagio. Slow, slow. Ready? Ready? Stand up. Sit down. Stand up. Turn around. Turn back. Sit down. Stand up, sit down, reach up, 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 Okay, now we're going to something a little like andante, like a good walking pace. I need to check it here. We'll do it. This is my friend metronome. It's a little old, but. Okay, it's a little faster, so let's be ready, okay? Ready? This is our beat. Bum, bum, Stand up, sit down. Stand up, turn around, turn around, sit down, stand up, sit down, sit down, sit down, stand up, sit down, reach up, reach down, reach up, stand up, reach up, reach up, reach up, sit down. Good. Who is ready to go faster? Give me thumbs up. Yes. Are we ready to go faster? Yes. Okay, faster. It's an allegro, which means happy. The tempo allegro is happy. And we actually have the music for allegro. So be ready. Are we ready? Are we ready? Okay, ready? Stand up, sit down, stand up, sit down, reach up, reach down, reach up, stand up, sit down. Stand up, sit down, stand up, stand up, stand up, sit down, stand up, sit down, stand up, sit down, reach up, reach down, reach up, stand up, reach up, sit down. Good job! Guys, were you able to follow? Yeah, I saw people going up and down, up and down. That was beautiful. So, if you want, we can even go faster. Who wants to not go faster? Me. Who wants to go faster? <laughs> We try? Okay, this is really fast. It's called presto. Presto. Okay, guys, we can do it. Ready? 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 Okay, it's like this. Okay, 
One, two, three, four, stand up. Stand up, sit down, stand up, turn around, turn back, sit down, stand up, sit down, stand up, sit down, sit up, sit down, sit up, sit up, sit up, sit up. Good job, good job, guys. Give yourself a big clap. You've been beautiful. Let's continue down at the beautiful music. Bye-bye. Oh, that was wonderful. Thank you, Miss Gloria. That, that, was, that was particularly good for the COVID times, boys and girls, because we need to have a strong heart and lungs, isn't it? Okay. Yeah. So, okay, so since the Memorial Day is coming soon, I thought that I, I should teach you some patriotic song too, just like our no, docent, Miss Jay Jayati. Okay, so uh, let me share my screen first for you. Um, okay, um, are you guys able to see my screen? Okay, so here we go. Um, boys and girls, the song which I'm going to teach you today, it's uh, This Land is Your Land. And this is one of the United States most famous folk song. And the lyrics is written by the American folk singer Woody Guthrie in 1940s. So, okay, boys and girls, without much ado, let's go for the song. For that, for this song, we are going to stand up, push our chair a little bit aside, and I hope I am visible. My <clears throat> okay, here we go. So the song is "This Land Is Your Land." This land is my land. Okay, so for this, we are going to show a hand sign. We are going to show this land. Your turn. This, this land, land is your land. It's your land. This land, this land, land. your turn, sorry. This, this Land is my land. My land. Good job. Now let's go for the next line. Okay. What is this land is all about? From where to where? What land is your land and, and my land? So the land from California. You can show California to the New York Island. You can show me. Show with me. Your turn. California. To the New York okay. Island. Good job. As you can see on the map, boys and girls, all the place in the United States that belongs to you and me. Yes, it does. What is there in our land? Our land has redwood forest. Can you all show redwood forest? Yes. So you can see from the redwood forest. Your turn, redwood forest. Redwood forest. To the Gulf Stream waters. Your turn. To, to the, the Gulf, Gulf Stream, Stream waters. Good job. Okay. This land, your turn. This land, land. was made was your turn made, made, made for, for you and me. me. Was you. made for you and me. me. Yes. So boys and girls, let's try to sing this one chorus with me. Okay. The song goes something like this. One line I will share and then you can copy me. Okay. This land is your land. Your turn. This, this land, land is your land. This land is my land. This your turn. This, this land, land is my land. From California. Your turn. 
from California to the New York Island. Your turn. To the New York Island. From the Redwood Forest. Your turn. From the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters. Your turn. To the Gulf Stream waters. This land was made for you and me. Your turn. This land was made for you and me. Okay, we say land like this in the sign, sign language. Okay, don't forget. Okay, so boys and girls, with this chorus, I want you all to keep a beat on your lap. Once the chorus is over, we are going to tap our lap. We are going to patch our la lap. Or if we have a table in front of me, if, if in front of us, so we can just tap the table just like this, and we can sing the chorus. Do you do you mind singing with me? Let's let's try together this time. Okay. This, this land is your land. This land is my land. From California to the New York Island, from the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters, this land was made for you and me. Great job, boys and girls. So let me let me tell you the. No, Next, there are two verses. Actually, this song is pretty long and very interesting. So let's try to sing this chorus with the music this time, okay? And try to sing this chorus whenever you hear the chorus in the song, okay? Here we go. Let's try to copy my action and try to sing it together, okay? This land is your land. As I was walking down the highway, I saw a baby. That in the sky, I saw a baby. This land was made for me. This land is yours. This land is mine. From California to New York Island, from the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters, this land was made for me. I roamed and rambled, and I followed my footsteps, the sparkling sands of your diamond desert, and all around me, a voice came sounding, this land was made for you and me. Sing it together. Thank you. 
Yes, of course. This land is made for you and me. Thank you so much, boys and girls. That was amazing. Okay, so after this, we are going to. Oh, yeah. After this, we are going to have an instrument song which our teacher is going to present. And it's about music, music, music. Whoa, let's <laughs> learn it from her. She's awesome teacher. Look at what I found in my kitchen. I bet all of you have a wooden spoon somewhere. And sorry, I'm going in and out with my background. Um, find two wooden spoons. That's all you need, two wooden spoons. But if you also have some rhythm sticks, that would be great. I'll go ahead and use the rhythm sticks so you can see how they work. But two things, even if you have two pencils, that would be fine. So just go find two pencils or even two pens. But pencils might be a little longer, which would be good. So this song is called Music, Music, Music. And you get to use an instrument as well as your body as you're moving. And this is how it's going to go. Let me see if most of you have found something. If you can't find anything, of course, you can use your hands. You can always clap. It's okay. But try to find your wooden spoons or your, your instruments, your rhythm sticks or your wooden spoons or two pencils. Okay, Mrs. Zilly first, and then I'll point to you. Okay. Our sticks tap high. Your turn. Sing it now. Our sticks tap high. My turn. I'm going to do the same thing, but I'm going to do it low. Our sticks tap low. Okay, just two strikes. Go ahead. Our sticks tap low. Then we're going to put them right in the front. We tap again. Your turn. We tap again. And then you can turn around. I'm kind of hooked on with my, my uh, ear, earphones here. But you turn around. For about four beats, we turn around, right? And we put our sticks on our hips like this. And we shake our hips. And we shake our sticks. And watch me first. To music, music, music. So you sing that and tap. To music 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 okay i'm i'm connected so i'm probably not gonna be able to do too much in the way of my movement i might just stay with what we just did okay because it's not hard and i know you'll catch on because we're going to do it again and again if i have you go to the side maybe you can do it maybe you can do it but we're not going to be kicking i don't think <laughs> it's a little tight quarters for me today okay i think you're ready show me your sticks this is ready position because they're not touching. And when you make an X, that's the play position. Okay, so let's get in ready. I hope you found something. And follow me because I know you'll catch on really easily. And as long as there it comes. Ready? Our stick step high, our stick step low. We tap up, turn around. We shake our hips, shake our sticks to music, music. Try it again. Our stick step high, our stick step low. We tap again and around we go. We shake our hips, shake our sticks to music, music. Watch me now. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Now we do up and we wait. Up, up, front and back, front, back, front, back, front, back, front, back, front, back. Two each would be better. Front, front, back. Side, 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 other side. Clap your hands if you don't have anything. Side, 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 switch, side, side. Let's sing it again. Our sticks tap high, our sticks up low. We tap again and around we go. We shake our hips, 
shake our sticks to music, music, music. We're not going to kick, so we're just going to tap. Tap, 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 tap. Tap, 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 tap. And we sing again. Big voices. Our sticks tap high, our sticks tap low. We tap again and around we go. We shake our hips, shake our sticks to music, music, music. And we stop. Good job, boys and girls. Whoopsie. Very good. So we can make music with homemade wooden sticks or anything else that we could tap or our hands because our body is a wonderful instrument and we don't even need anything else because we could clap, we can tap, we can make all kinds of wonderful sounds. Um, I think I'll turn it over to you, Priya for our te some testimonials maybe yeah thank you so much Ms. mrs dilly uh -huh. okay boys and girls we have learned till now such a wonderful songs and dance and instrument things oh that was so nice do you want to know a little bit more about the docent who shared today i want to know a little bit more about their story from their from themselves so how about we ask mrs miss gloria to share something with us today. Yes, Gloria, this is for you now. Take the screen. Well, just in two words, you know, guys, like, I don't know how you feel after one hour of music. Do you feel more energized, more, your heart feels better? Yes? Oh, no. So usually <laughs> with me, this happens. So music for me is like a little like the air that we breathe. It's really important for me. And it's really a big part of my life. So when i saw mrs Dilly presenting at niles elementary and teaching in class i thought mm, i would like to do the same for my children so every every week now i i go in the classes of my children and other children and it's so much fun and i actually recommend it to all the parents because you are with your children with your friends with the teachers and it's just uh, such a uh, fulfilling experience it's fun uh, it's healthy, and you are in the middle of the community of, of your children. So with music, there is nothing better. For me, music is magic. So I hope everybody will, will share it every day. So. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Gloria. That was very nice. Okay, now let's let's listen from our next docent, Ms. Jayanti. Ms. Jayanti, please tell us something about yourself too. Hi, you guys. Uh, it's me, Ms. Jay, again. Um, so I'm very happy to be here. I'm a new docent. I started teaching uh, only this year in the month of January. And I've been having a tremendous uh, time uh, in my class. I teach at Brookwell Elementary in the first grade in my daughter's class. And it's been an amazing experience. Um, so every single week, um, I mean, apart from music, there's just so much of connection I'm able to make with the kids. And I, I actually, I, I feel so great that they also feel the same way. They enjoy the music so much. And it's been so beneficial uh, for the children and also the teacher, actually. The teacher comes back to me, tells that she looks forward to the Friday so much. Uh, it, it really makes such a difference for all of our lives. Um, so I I cannot not help but say that I, I admire the Music for Minors 2 team so much. Um, it's, I, I feel honored to be associated with every single uh, person in the team. Uh, there's so much of dedication, passion, uh, hard work, and teamwork. Everything seen in the same place, and it inspires me so much. Um, so uh, I think the whole energy uh, keeps me, it keeps us all going, and keeps me going. So. Um, I, I just uh, think that every child has to be uh, surrounded by some form of music. And uh, I believe as uh, adults and parents, uh, we all need to come together and help with that. Um, so I really appreciate the time that I got today. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, uh, Ms. Jade. That was 
That was nice. Okay, I, I have something. I think Ms. Vida wants to share something with us today. Uh, Ms. Vida, um, do, you, do you mind uh, taking a place of Serena because she's not here today? She's not feeling well, I guess. I can, do, I can share the training flyer, Carol, if you want to do your recruitment. Yes, yes. Thank yeah, you. Uh, so, so parents and friends that are viewing now, uh, the way the pro the way the music gets to the children is through the adult that we train every fall. It'll start up in I think middle of September once again, and it's a free training, and you have the time of your life, and we sing it. And, and what you've seen today will show you uh, some of the things that we do, just very few of the things that we do. But there's our fall training. It's only 11 sessions and it's free to you. And you get to find the joy that is within you, the child that is within you and your strengths. And we help you, we support you. There are mentors. Uh, it is a real team effort to, to have you transition into a classroom. This year, it had to be virtual. We are hoping for sure to get back into the real classroom soon, but we help you either way. And uh, all you need is to commit to the training, love music and children, and know that they should never be separated. And our flyer here that Vera is showing is also on our website. But Music for Minors 2 has primarily served um, the TK to the sixth grade, you know, the preschool, we, we do a little bit with our preschoolers, uh, but basically, mostly it's been an elementary curriculum that we share in singing and dance and rhythm instruments and all sorts of things that we weren't able to show you tonight. But two of our board members, who I'm about to introduce to you, uh, Lori and RJ, uh, are so kind. They are professional musicians. They've been very supportive of Music for Minors too and joined our board, our board of directors. Um, and we've been so appreciative of that, but they are willing to do, and I'm going to let Lori do most of this, uh, but they're willing to offer something for the preschoolers at home who, who don't have the opportunity to be in an official classroom this, this past year and even into the future. So I'm going to let Lori uh, do all that she can to convince all of you out there, <laughs> for any preschooler that's out there, to join these two terrific people. Take it, Lori. Thank you so much, Carol. And for us, it's an honor to be able to share the love of music that we have, that we grew up with 24 seven, all the time. We always had music in our lives. And even as children in school, there was music. And as we know, we need all of you docents to be a part and, and the volunteers to be a part of getting the music back to the children. Not so much, okay, the classroom, yes we got to get it in the classroom but the more that we all can do to share this love of music love is is very special and is very passionate to us and we've been very fortunate to be able to play music for children and we believe that we inspire them and as one of the board members the both of us are on the board of music for minors too so you know that we are pushing for the music just like Carol and everybody else on the board and we saw that there was a little bit of a gap for the little little bitty kids that you know might not be able to be quite in school yet or they're at home and watching their brothers or sisters online or going to school so we thought we would create a really cool musical fun program now I wanted to ask you um am, can I share a screen with you guys yeah. Can I? I can? Yeah. Okay. I want to just show you real fast. Okay. Share screen. Oh, it's just saying host participant. Oh, yes. Yeah, she would have sharing. to let you. Vera. Right. Let's see if she'll let me in. Yeah. Um, I'll wait. I'll wait until I get in. But you can do it now. Lori. You can do it now. Do it now? Okay. I'll make you co host. Okay. I am going to share this little flyer with you. Basically, this is kind of sort of what it is in a nutshell. We're going to have fun. We're going to do it on Zoom. It's going to be for our little friends. I don't know why it's kind of weird over here, but it is, it's not Mondays and Wednesdays. It's only going to be on Monday. We're going to explore music and shapes and colors and animals and measurements and calendars and just all the things that we all need to know 
in a musical way. So it will be weekly and it is what we call connective learning. So the songs will be connected to the music, to the movements, to the things that we're learning. So I'm going to unshare this now and give you just a little snippet. Well, let me first tell you this way before we do that. No, I'll tell you at the end. But this is one of the songs that we wrote about okay. measurements. So here Step we go. One, two, three, four. Let's learn about measurements, inches and feet. It's not that hard. Just listen to me. One inch. You can clap How your long hands. How short could that be? A one inch. It's about the size of a bumblebee. A one inch. It's smaller than a car key. A one inch. A bite of banana you'd eat. <laughs> Let's sing about measurements. How long? How short? Let's figure this out. participate with you this evening express the music that's love it. the music we yeah. are the music that's right <laughs> oh great okay that was that was so nice boys and girls we, we could hear the music the instrument live oh that was such a pleasure thank you so much lori and rj thank you that was wonderful 
And thank you to all the docents because we are at the end of our event. And uh, okay, we don't say bye bye just like that. We say it with the help of music. And here we go. Our teacher is going to teach us goodbye song. Yes, Miss Carol, please. Yes, take thank you so much, Lori and RJ. It was wonderful. And that's just a little teeny snippet, a little flea size of what joyful things you're going to have, boys and girls. And you know, you're a preschooler, but if your older brother or sister wants to join in, they can join in too. Um, but especially for that age group that doesn't seem to have that much offered for them. So Music for Minors 2 is starting this brand new, coming up in June. And I just want to remind the parents that um, the best way to guarantee that your child's going to have music in their classroom is to consider whether you could become a music docent and get this cute t-shirt that we all wear. Um, and if not you, maybe you know someone. It could be your neighbor. It could be a friend, a relative. We just need to get the word out that the way we reach thousands of children is if we have many, many more volunteers that become docents. And you learn so much about music. So it's a free class and it helps you as well as the children, but one of you can reach 24 children at one time in a classroom. And now more than ever, they need music because look at what we've all been through. They need it for their academic success, but they need it for their social development and emotional well-being. And that's why we want to continue our mission in Music for Minors too, to reach many more children. So what if I said, see you later, what do you think you might say? See you later. Uh, alligator. alligator. Yeah. And if I said, after a while, you might say, crocodile. Uh, and how about if I said, see you later? Mashed potato. I want you to go like this and with your feet mashing the floor. See you soon. Macaroon. Say goodbye. We're sorry that we have to leave, but say goodbye. Pumpkin pie. Toodaloo. And then you can all be kangaroos. Catch you later. Operator. Adios. Cinnamon toast. See you later. Now get your air guitar out. Get your pretend rock guitar. You're going to be a rock star in two seconds when we finish up this song. And let's hope Mrs. Zilly can get it to play. Come on. Oh, gosh. There it is. Play that guitar. And don't forget to sing. You'll catch on really quick. Let's do it. See you later, alligator. After a while, crocodile. See you later, mashed potato. See you soon, macaroon. Say goodbye, pumpkin pie. Toodaloo, kangaroo. Catch you later, operator, adios, cinnamon toast, see you later. Windshield wipers, don't forget at the end, it's going to be a big see you later. See you later, alligator, after a while, crocodile, see you later, mashed potato, see you soon, macaroon, say goodbye, pumpkin pie. Toodaloo, kangaroo, catch you later, operator, adios, cinnamon toast, see you later, a big see you later when I point to you, ready, see you later. Good job, boys and girls, good job, and I just want to thank Priya, thank you Priya, docent Priya from James Leach, how wonderful she did to put this all together, how much wonderful work she does. Vera, our program manager. I don't know if Serena is still on, Serena Wong, I'm not sure if she's on, but all the wonderful docents. The program exists because of wonderful people who have the real heart 
for music and children. And thank you so much for coming. And Priya, you can say something if you'd like uh, at the end, but uh, excuse me, Priya, but be sure to go to our website, parents, and go to our Facebook page and, and you know, like us and visit us often because we have wonderful things to share with you on our Facebook page. And uh, we don't want you to miss out because it'll enrich your whole family. Thank you, Priya, if you wanted to say something that's fine thank you so much everybody for joining us tonight it was real pleasure to have you all tonight in our music for minus two's family music night it was all for you thank you so much for joining Bye -bye. see you later see you later <laughs> <laughs> bye bye, bye, -bye. bye. Hey, thank you for coming thank bye. you thank you thank you have a look for our look for our monthly music and movement too. Meant to say that bye. music and movement. Thank you. Bye, bye, Kara. Bye, Larry. Bye, RJ. Thank bye, you. Bye, RJ. Thanks, bye. Jay. Bye. Thank you. Bye, Vera. <laughs> bye, bye. Thank you. So you guys still in Texas? You. We are in. Te we are in Texas, y'all. Yeah. Where's my cowboy, yeah. cowboy hat, RJ? Give me my cowboy hat. <laughs> uh, it's but, different. It's different here, I must say. Yeah, probably it's is. Different. Um, we see a lot of smiling faces. Oh, no good. one's wearing masks. Yes, not a lot, not a lot, and uh, they're just happy and thriving and. It's been Great. raining a lot, but oh. other than that, they have unseasonably cool weather, thank goodness. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's yeah. hot. It's steamy. Yeah. We're not used to the humidity. We're such wimps, but <laughs> other than that, it's pretty good. But thank you guys so much, and thank you for your patience. Like it's song. been... Uh, did you like that song? It's oh, yes. I loved it. Uh, I loved I, it. I, loved I, it. I, I liked how RJ asked all the questions. Is this bigger than this? And yeah yeah that was nice yeah it'll they be are... when we get to interact with the kids and yeah the question because i heard them going it's a dinosaur <laughs> you're so creative Lori, when it's updated yeah send me the flyer and we'll post it on facebook yeah, and, I'll post and everything yeah well what's funny is, is i didn't even have a copy and so what I did, oh. I found like the first, very first thing we had, and I threw it into a program and I put that together like as fast as I could just to have something visual. But yeah. Katya is working on it and I think okay. he'll be back soon. Okay. So we'll yeah. get it together and so will we. And we were here, you know, sort of on a healing mission for my mom. So yeah. it's, you know, it's, it's, everything's okay, but we've been pretty focused on, you know, what's happening. In yes. Austin. Yeah. But oh, you're you're amazing. Your creativity is amazing. Just amazing. What you do, what you do. Thank, Thank you, Lori. You guys too. You know, we're all we're in the same tribe, guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. That's right. That's you're right. We're all crazy like we are. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you too. Oh, it's like 10 o'clock for us. Now. I was just going to say, what time is it there? Yeah. And the bed. <laughs> yeah. It's zoned out still. But anyway, yeah. thank you guys. I'm going to leave the meeting if you guys want to continue your chat. Okay. 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 Be in touch. Thank you, Lori. Thank bye, you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. Um, bye. Stay safe. Yeah. Well done, Priya. Went well. Yes. <laughs> Did it. Yeah, oh, yeah. Priya, you're so darling. Your personality.